Earthwatch Weather Center with the very latest. Yeah, up here at Earthwatch, though, we are agreed there will be no snow in Philadelphia. Now, around the area, there's a little possibility of a bit, but we'll talk about that in a minute. Temperatures are getting down to wintertime areas at our WeatherNet school up in Doylestown. It's always a little cooler than the rest of us, 38 degrees now, but you only went to 39 today, 28 this morning. That was a frosty beginning, wasn't it? Light breeze out of the east now. That's a little troublesome but it's very light breeze. At the airport today, the high temperature made it to 43 degrees, exactly where it was forecast here last night. 56 would be the normal, 74 the record high. And around the area now, at six o'clock, these temperatures up in the Poconos, not any rain falling around here, but there is some out by, I mean, or snow either, for that matter, a little mixture out by Harrisburg and up toward Indian Town Gap, out by State College. What was a little mixture is now changed to all rain out that way. Watching the system from down here as it pushes toward the north. This is the late radar from here, edging up into parts of central Pennsylvania. I think we'll get something well ahead of midnight here tonight, but this is what we're looking for. In the Poconos, one to three inches of snow, but it's going to change over to all sleet up there. That's going to be troublesome. No accumulation from the Lehigh Valley out toward the Lancaster-Harrisburg area. And for down in here, it's going to be all rain. The problem's up in the Poconos, where it's going to get about four inches of heavy sleet. Uh, early morning and through a good bit of the morning tomorrow. So that's going to be troublesome. The rest of us get away except down at the shore. So the storm breakdown, by midnight it starts. Peak time, 7 a.m. to 3 p.m. tomorrow. City and suburbs, one inch of rain largely. No travel troubles except for the wet leaves and that sort of thing. Up in the Lehigh Valley and Redding, sleet will change over to rain. And the Poconos, two to three inches of snow, then some troublesome sleet tomorrow. You have a wintry forecast. Down by the shore, Moderate coastal flooding, some beach erosion, trouble for you too. Tides two to three feet above normal, and the wind's going to be a factor for all of us. Heaviest at the shore, where they'll hit about 40 miles an hour. Around Philadelphia, the forecast says our winds may pick up to maybe 20, 25 miles an hour overnight tonight. Rain may start as sleet, especially north and west of the city, and windy as the night goes on. 35 in the suburbs, 38 degrees in Philadelphia. Those are not snow accumulating temperatures at all. The call for the five days, starting with tomorrow. Windy rain, raw cold, and down with the, up in the Poconos, some heavy sleet in the temperatures tomorrow. Holding on the cold side from about 38 to around 45 in the city. Rain tomorrow, wind-blown rain and cold. Could have a flurry on Saturday. This, system moved, this rain area moves out of here late tomorrow. Saturday, uh, 41 degrees and cold and a chance of a flurry, windy and very cold on Sunday, 38 degrees, okay, or recovering from Monday. East at 15 to 25 miles an hour. There's still a chance of some precipitation in the form of sh rain showers on Saturday, as you can see. Not a whole lot of rain, but showers. And then Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday, gradual clearing trend, but look at the temperatures. Only getting up to 40 degrees on Sunday and Monday. And by the way, Sunday's going to be a windy day, so wind chills will be a factor for the first time this year. Stephanie? Here we go. Dave Roberts and AccuWeather. David? Do we see some snowflakes? That is the question. Before it changes all over to rain, this is going to be a rain event, but we're looking for the possibility of some snow early on. Here's the current radar picture. Take a look at it now. Two distinct systems, one off the coast, now edging on over portions of Pennsylvania. The other, well, to the west, Kentucky and Tennessee, the western portion on into southern Indiana and Ohio. But a portion of that is just kind of overlapping on into Pennsylvania. Uh, let's set it in motion now, action radar, and you watch the development of these two systems as we continue to track them. You see that one system just kind of spreading into Pennsylvania. It's all light stuff right now, and most of it is rain, but we'll give you the mix. Action radar will break it down for you, and you can see the white areas will show you most of that, uh, that light snow as well to the west. And then uh, along the southern tier of Pennsylvania there, we see some changeover. That remains to our west. We're watching the system to our south which is all light precipitation right now as it moves in because the cold air is in place. What does it mean for tonight? All right, city and south, we're looking for some snow and sleep. Then a change over to rain between 10 p.m. and 1 a.m. By 1 a.m., city and south, we expect it to be all rain. North and west, some snow, sleet, and rain. 10 p.m., a little bit longer till 5 o'clock in the morning. If anything at all, we'll get maybe a coating, especially northern and western suburbs on the lawns, maybe a little slushy stuff. Cold air in place, one system there, again, it continues to move away. Another system down here moving to our west, trying to break off and feed some moisture into this system here. So we just have to continue to watch both of them to see how things go. Golf from AccuWeather is, well, 
We've got a mix to start. They're already freezing. The Poconos 37 in Allentown, 40 in Wilmington. Of course, a little bit warmer down here in Cape May, 48, 42 in Atlantic City. 32 was our low, the official high 43 degrees at 310. Let's take a look now at the 6 o'clock numbers. Live on Sky 6, present temperature reading 41 degrees humidity, up to 60%. The barometer 30.06, it is falling. Winds out of the east at 16 miles per hour. Yes, it's cold outside. The wind chill indicates it feels like 23 degrees in the northeast. 42, 42 outside the station. The same for Center City, 41 at the airport in Camden, 40 degrees. The exclusive AccuWeather five-day forecast, we're looking for some snow, sleet, and rain, and then a change over to all rain, 36 degrees. Tomorrow will be a rainy, windy, and cold day with a high of only 44 degrees. Winds out of the northeast up to 30, perhaps 35 miles per, uh, per hour. A gale warning down at the New Jersey and Delaware coast. Cloudy and chilly, 46 degrees, maybe a flake. Sunday, windy and colder, 38 degrees, maybe another flake. 42, 48 degrees, windy and cold. Tuesday looks like a pretty nice day. But we've got to get through that system. We'll continue to track it for you on Satellite 6 and Action Radar. All right.